jump in there and you get the itch for a while. Detroit Lakes ranks high on the list for best beaches, but some say the water quality is not award winning. Thank you for joining us tonight. The lakes are the place to be this weekend, and Detroit Lakes is already swimming with people. There's a lot of talk about growth in that area, but there's also a lot of talk about what's growing in the water. So if you're heading to the lakes this weekend, Valley News Team's Nicole Johnson shows us what the quality of the lake is like right now. The water is nice, and it's nice to swim in. A lot of people don't think twice before jumping right in. Do you want to watch me go swimming with yes, that yeah, camera? Frankie Boitcher wasn't shy about showing us her swimming skills. She comes to Detroit Lakes most weekends with her grandma. Have you ever got swimmer's itch before? Mm, my brother did. Never did. Okay. And what was that like? It was horrible. He was covered in hives um, all over the place, and we had to give him, they, the doctor said, an oatmeal bath. Everybody does not get the swimmers in. Quality bait and tackle owner John Store hasn't swam in 40 years. Fathead. What'd you call me? He hates swimmer's itch, but says you won't have to worry about it this weekend. It hasn't been hot enough, long enough for that. When the water warms up, that's when you get that algae. It takes more than one hot weekend for blue algae to grow. Store says maybe in a month, it's going to be a problem. Perfect beach, mm -hmm. you know, and it's, it's just the quality of the water when you get to the end of July and, and the beginning of August. Fourth of July, a lot of stuff gets thrown in the lake, but it's a pretty clean lake. I mean, you're going to get something no matter where you go. It just depends on the type of people that are in it. So if you're like Frankie and want to jump right in. Probably the best it's going to be compared to what it will be 4th of July. So if you want to swim, swim now. In Detroit Lakes, Nicole Johnson, Valley News Live. Store says there's a major weed problem along the shore for homeowners, but says that's a problem they have every year. Authorities